I was on a roll with this game for a bit, then I kind of took a breather, but we are back here with episode 5. Uh, so for episode 5, these first couple maps have a unique concept, in my opinion. Like the original episode 2, 4, 5, there's not a lot of rooms. And there's, it, there's smaller and compact maps. Th this map in 4, 2, the rooms are bigger. Well, mainly one large room, and the rest are still big, but not as deadly as, like, the one big room. Um, so these first maps are, they're smaller, but they are filled with, you know, fewer rooms and larger rooms and more challenging. For this map, that opening room is deadly. Thank goodness there were no mutes. Well, yet. Especially since you have very few supplies and a machine gun to start with coming right out of the start room. It makes it hard. Especially as always as I mentioned, the enemies far away from you that can see you. What makes this map even harder is that it can be tricky to get 100% kills because there are some enemies behind pillars that you cannot get to and they can wander around just like they did in a couple previous maps. I think back in like episode 3 it was, I believe, we had that one map that enemies were like hiding out behind the pillars and we just couldn't get to them. So it can be a little bit of a pain, but you know, it wasn't too bad, we got it this time. But yeah, that is floor one guys, on the floor two in the next video. And until then, I am the Club of the Man, 1993.